morning everybody out there getting started it feels good to be back to work it's monday morning it's gonna be another marvelous monday in baltimore well actually we're heading up to green spring me and mr jimmy electrics in a little debate because the fine folks we're working for call where we're heading to towson but it's actually in the corner of green spring pike i mean could be like Pikesville, depending on who's talking it. But we're heading towards the Towson vicinity. We're cleaning out the monastery or something to do with the monastery. Don't worry, we're not losing our religion. Faith no more, you know, them old songs or hits. We still have our faith. We still love, you know, the man above. That's just a little bit about us. Sorry if I offend anyone. I don't want to offend anybody, but... Um, just driving up our 83 northbound should be there in a few moments so as always it's always good to get back to work on a Monday morning Sundays are nice to take off but you know I still have to answer questions do office work so I'm never really off I'm always by the phone it's just part of the business when you're a small owner um, but just to spare you guys a few moments because as I always mention we care about your time so we're going to turn that off for a couple of minutes and when we get there we'll do our fabulous walk through so you can see our before and after shots find out what's going on so see you guys in a moment here we go look how beautiful there's part of the monastery over there it's pretty beautiful they own multiple properties Look at this place. This is one of their properties up here in Towson. Me and Jim came to the conclusion that yes, this is Towson, but it's just under lower Green Spring Valley. It's a beautiful home. Anyway, I'm gonna do our walk through like I always do. The young man is opening up the basement. I'm gonna show you what kind of demolition. This is like, light demolition work we're doing hey jimmy want to say anything yet he's good he's a little short on words the old guy didn't get him breakfast or coffee but that's just how it goes no time for breakfast and coffee i'm gonna walk up here i'm gonna show you we gotta take care of this stuff here let me walk through in here where's we're going to take up this rug, take these few pieces of furniture like we agreed upon. We got to take down the ceiling tiles, clean them out, and then put them back so the young fella can do whatever he needs to do, clean out the rafters. Basically, we're going to take up these carpets like I mentioned. Oh, there's a nudie book. Oh. Don't worry, we're not going to look at that, not while we're getting paid. But I'm not going to tell you because I don't want to lie to you fine folks. So also, we're gonna go over in here. The young fella has this little crawl space. It has a few items, you can't really see too good. We're gonna clean all that out, okay? We're gonna clean all that junk out of that crawl space because not only do we do demolition work, light, heavy, hard, it doesn't matter. We take away carpet, pad, tack strips, everything um walls retaining walls you name it concrete block um but we also do a lot of crawl spaces attics we go where you don't want to go because that's what we do we love what we do we're glad to be back to work so again that's just a little bit about what's going to transpire it's going to take us it's going to take us probably a couple hours um, to take care of this little bit of mess, not not too extensive. I'm going to turn this off because I don't want to walk you through the next couple hours, but you're going to see the before and after. Okay, the carpet, ceiling tiles are all coming down to clean out. And it's a beautiful day in the county we're gonna walk it up here you know feel that humidity already and cut it with a knife 
So, love hearing them birds chirping. We're about midway through. There's some of the chairs, carpeting. As always, at no extra, we're gonna clean up these steps. No additional. We have to clean everything up, but we're about midway through. I'll show you what we got here. We just got this carpet about licked. All the ceiling tiles are down. We cleaned out the rafters. We're gonna do a nice sweep up. I'll show you the end. Oh, Mr. Jim already knocked out that little bit of carpet. The tiles we're keeping. And then here's a better shot from what I showed you earlier. We're gonna clean out this miscellaneous junk. Cause like I mentioned before, we do grow in crawl spaces. Crawl spaces, attic spaces, any places is where we go. Except not in your faces. We love our customers. We love what we do. Jim, how much do you love them, Owen? Well, I like talking to them. He like, say that again, Jim. I don't know if the camera went out. Did he good? He likes demo and a lot more than junk removal. Yeah, I much prefer demo. Much prefer demo. It's a little more lengthy. And uh, junk removal is a little tricky, but I'll be touching base with you in a moment. Walk through. Here we go. We've been here a few hours. Carpet, pad, tack strip is up like promised. Right, wasn't too horrible. Everything, we cleaned out the rafters. We even threw this in as no extra. She had a carpet and a pad, a 10 by 12. Saved her a few bucks there. We took that up and our price there since it wasn't as bad. And that crawl space, I'm gonna show you this crawl space just to let you see everything. We cleaned up in there, took all the debris out. Is that a dirt floor back here? Um, I'm not sure. You got to ask my guy. Um, I think it's kind of concrete type, but you can ask him. Okay. Clean up everything in here. Um, walk in on out, beat the rugs, show you the truck, and then he's going to move. Clean up the steps and everything. Nice and neat. There he goes. Right there. I'm going to wash my hands, if you don't mind. Right where the truck was, everything. Right, right there, cleaned up everything, nice and neat. Walked around, no damage to the property, and he's putting it over there, right there. Now, I just saw her, I'm gonna meet with her, let her do her walkthrough, make sure I wanna always do my walkthrough. Okay. As we always do at Attic Sweepers, we always do a walkthrough. So make sure she's happy, see, no damage to the property to the yard, we're always careful about that. So, yeah, I just saw her walk back over as she went back somewhere else. This guy, he's the maintenance man around here, Mr. Ben, Big Ben in Baltimore here. He's not in Pittsburgh, I'm trying to let you in. There you, there you go. Yes, she is. Oh. All right, we'll do our little walk through. Here we are, sir. Okay. Where's Miss Kathy? Uh, I think she's down in the basement. Okay, well. Okay, we're coming, we're coming. Okay. Yeah, we're looking for you up here. <laughs> yep. Okay. Yeah, we already did the walk through here. Oh, you did, okay. Took the, well, no, I'm gonna do it with you. Oh, okay. Here's the area rug you wanted. Uh -huh. I already explained why we didn't take those nails up. We didn't right. want to damage the floor. Right. Everything cleaned up in there. Mm -hmm. Everything, walk over in here. Been up that was probably a light fixture. Huh. This is a, this is just a this could be cut down. It's just oh, it's connected to that. Yeah, it's connected in the okay. wall. It's electric. Here. I'm gonna get this. Now, did attic sweepers do everything that they promised? I think so. Looks good down there. What do you think, Mr. Ben? I think it looks good. Thank okay. you. Okay. Would you hire them guys again? Of yes. Course. Are they funny or good at what they do? They're a little funny. And they're very good at what they do. Okay, would you give us any thumbs up? What do you think? Thumbs up. That will conclude today's episode here up in Towson, Maryland. Cleaning out this demo and a little job, whatever. We do everything in all of Baltimore County. Thank you for taking a few minutes out of your day. 
I'm Bill with Attic Sweepers Holland. That's Bill with Attic Sweepers Holland and Junk Removal. You can reach us at AtticSweepersHolland.com. Until we meet again, good night. Good night.